Hey, hello everyone. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to find the sum of all the values present in the dictionary. So I'm going to show you two methods. One is by using the for loop and another one is by using the inbuilt function sum. So let's get started. First, let's declare a dictionary. Okay, let D be our dictionary. So D equal to, let us say A, A has a value 1. Uh, B has a value of 2 and C has a value of 3. Okay. C has a value of 3. Okay. That's fine. So this is our dictionary. This is the A, B, and C are the key, and 1, 2, 3 are the values. So if you print the sum, we need to get the sum as 6. Okay. So what we'll do is by using for loop is that we'll just iterate to the values present in the dictionary and just store in a temporary variable sum equal to 0. Okay. So for iterating to the values, we have the dot a dictionary dot values function. So it's going to be like this for uh, for i in d dot values. Okay. So this is the function. This basically corresponds to the values. Okay, one, two, three, and then it's just simple. Sum equal to sum plus i. That's it. We just print sum. We will be getting the output as six. Okay. So as you can see, here we are getting the output as six. That's fantastic. And Another method that I told you is directly by using the inbuilt function sum. It's just same. Just copy this. Okay. Just copy this. Just remove everything. Just go over here. Sum is the function itself. The name of the function itself is sum. So we're not going to change anything. Just paste it inside. That's it. Think it has correctly closed. Okay. One, two. That's fine. So now if you just run it, I'll be getting the output as six. So that's it. So simple. So two methods. One is this one, the that inbuilt, and another one is the for loop. Okay. So that's it for this video. And my program channel. I've done tutorials in C, C++, Java, and many other programs in Python, Blender, the distributed machine, and Unity. So do check other videos of my channel. Subscribe and support me. And thanks for watching.